Hello everybody, it's the Commander 35 back here again. But really, it's Jake back here again, me, Jake. And this is going to be a personal video. Uh, from me, directed to the fans of Star Wars, of any type of part of the sci-fi genre, of uh, fanboys, fangirls out there in this community, especially the Star Wars community. But whatever you collect, if it's Halo, Marvel, or Star Wars, or... Um, things from Predator or just different toy lines like NECA, Hasbro, Mega Bloks, Lego, all the things you collect, all the things you review, if you're a reviewer here on YouTube as well, um, just your passion for movies, whether it be the Star Wars films or any type of films, if you're a fanboy, you're most likely a part of this community by now because the community has gone pretty big. Uh, if you're not, definitely join it. If you're not making videos now and you're watching this, start up your channel and go have fun with it. But this video is going to be my video response to the community. Now, I'm going to be very honest and blunt. And there have been uh, things happening recently across the community. And I'm not going to go into detail with that. But... It sort of changed uh, my outlook officially on YouTube. And first off, I want to say, me, if you guys know me, I started back in 2010, uh, March 27th. And uh, I remember my first subscriber was uh, MK Films. You guys know him on here. And uh, that was like probably one of the best feelings I've ever had was getting my first subscriber. It was just, um, if you're watching, man, it's been a while since we talked. I don't I don't know if he's still on here or not, but if he is, let me send me a link to his channel. Um, but, yeah. I, do, I, always, I was always remember that because it was such a, such a cool moment that um, I uploaded my first videos, which were so shitty, and <laughs> I've, I have now removed them from my channel completely. And then came along this uh, awesome guy, and uh, he subscribed to me, and he commented on my video, and it, I had he was like my only viewer at the time, and that feeling was so powerful uh, to me. Being at like now I'm like a grown up teenager. Before I was like a child, like four years ago, almost like growing up into my teenagehood, hitting puberty and all that. So I was going through that little phase, like right at the very beginning of it. So I was like, let's see. 11 years old, 12 years old or something, and now I'm 16, so it's crazy, right, going back and looking at it, and I just want to thank him so much for that, because if it weren't for him, I don't know, um, maybe I wouldn't be there, because the thing is, uh, why I started YouTube mainly was because I, I saw all these reviewers out there. Like, you know, Filmmaker Mike, uh, the famous ones, uh, you know, uh, let's see, Commander Picard 198. I grew up, um, <laughs> I grew up on the YouTube world watching their channels to begin with, and, uh, I really, really enjoyed them. And, uh, now I watch hundreds of different videos from different channels because the community since then has grown so, uh, exponentially. It's just, it's just insane, and it's awesome. And I know that the whole Google and all that bullshit is fucking up YouTube. I Nothing I can do about that, guys. We've tried and we've complained and um, went belligerent all over the freaking place trying to shit all over Google Plus and all of it. They honestly, honest to God, they fucked it up. I'm going to swear, yes, they screwed up YouTube big time um, with comment system, with subscription systems, with deleting your subscribers and pissing people off. I understand that. They went through that whole purge like, like a year ago or something and they deleted like hundreds of subscribers from people's channels and it was, you know, it's like, hey, what the hell are you doing, you know? And for me, that is personally, even if a person deletes their channel, they still subscribed to you before, so obviously they cared about your channel enough and if their channel was gone for whatever reason it is, it's, I think in my opinion, it should, their subscription should stay even if their channel is removed uh, because, you know, but I'm not bitching about subscribers. I'm just saying, you know, if that person subscribed to you, leave it there. Don't come into people's channels and think you can just take over. Oh, yeah, get the hell out of here. We're taking your subscribers away. 
And so I can understand like how some people like are mad about that or were mad about that. And just the whole Google Plus thing where you ha you're like connected permanently. They like screwed up the whole inbox. I love the inbox on YouTube. They screwed that up. So messages are all messed up. You probably best bet is to go on Facebook and uh, you know commenting on U YouTube videos is kind of stressful. I will admit that. So. <laughs> I mean, no, nothing, per nothing rude against anybody. I'd love to comment on all your videos, but I can't get to all the time because it's just too many people, and um, just too many people. That's that's pretty much the bottom line. Too many people, and when I comment on videos, I want to be as honest and like I want to like try to give my passion to the comments and not just leave like a jack off comment like you know nice or something like that. And I want I want to give at least a sentence like saying you know expressing my feelings about it and. Uh, having fun with the guys and you know talking it out but can't always do that plus I have a job that I work five days a week on and I'm getting more hours like by the week because uh, I'll let you in a little secret we're losing workers so I'm being given more of their hours and uh, you know I'm taking it willingly because I like the money but um yeah that's why I'm not like on as much but even still I try to come on here because I have a lot of stress on myself too. You guys may think, oh yes, this screw this kid. He's a fucking teenager. Who, who the hell is he? What the hell does he know about stress? I actually do know about stress, a lot about stress. And uh, for me being as a collector, I, I'm sort of um, an outcast in my, my world. I'm sure most of you probably have experience with that. Uh, I was never bullied about it because I dropped out of kindergarten. I mean, well, not kindergarten, but. Uh, elementary and I moved into homeschooling so I was not really social with people in the real world uh, except for when I got to my job and from there on and it spread rapidly like that um, yeah and uh, and honestly if you wanna uh, if a lot of you out there think I'm an asshole which I'm sure most of you do because back in my beginning days I was sort of a jokester because the thing about me is I want to have fun with this. I want what my goal is on YouTube truly is to share my fandom and like express it so well to make other people happy to do it and to come uh, to feel wanting to do this. Like to, I want you guys to want to do this, you know, to come in here and join us, make the community bigger, share your feelings, don't you know sit in the background, become part of it, become you know, um, you know, show yourself or Nah, no, just show your figures or whatever. Just have fun with it. Uh, meet people because we, it's true. This world is a dark place, and we can all relate to that. If you're a collector, I'm sure there are some problems in your life somewhere, even more so than regular people. But uh, we're fanboys, fangirls, and I, I just want people to have fun. So, like, remember all the jokes of days back and then when I did Suicidal Troopers? I was pranking people's channels. It was not to be an asshole and cause an uproar in the community and uh, like start fights. And now a lot of you, a lot of collectors in the community that my friends on here don't know about, we got into fights and they don't talk to me anymore at all. And that's fine. And you want to unsubscribe? That's fine. Because it's not about subscribers. It's not about you're trying to give some sadistic feeling to yourself that you can you think that's going to hurt me. You think disliking my videos is going to hurt me either? No, it doesn't hurt me. It just shows that you got problems with the internet. This is not about raging and fighting. This is about to remove stress. It seems like you guys, the ones that are ang uh, vengeful and want revenge for some higher purpose or whatever it is in your head, it's not about that. This is about fun. Not about ratings, not about subscribers or views. And people might say to me, oh, not about subscribers, but you put subscribe at the end of your videos and you put like and subscribe and rate and all that. Well, uh, first I want to mention, I remove ratings permanently. It's done. No more ratings because uh, it's not about being the best reviewer, the best YouTuber for me. It's not about uh, having the most ratings, having the most, you know, most of that and all oh, the top quality reviewers. He's badass, so fuck all the other guys. I don't give a shit what they think. Let's go watch this top notch guy. Let's watch him love the figure just because uh, they're partnered and getting it for free. Yeah. Um, that's not to, to smite or spit in on any of those guys. I'm sure a lot of them do, a lot of these top reviews, they are professional, they're good, and their videos are obviously nice because they got the top quality cameras and they got all that, that bamboo shit. And, uh, cool, I'm glad they succeeded. I'm glad they got someone, they got famous off of toys, you know? <laughs> that's kind of a funny story to tell your children in the future, right? Hey, son. Hey, daughter. Your daddy here got famous off of toys collecting on YouTube. <laughs> you know, it'd be kind of that's kind of that's actually kind of a cool story, honestly. You never, you would never probably hear that, uh, but 
often. But yeah, and I'm not smiting any of my friends either. If you guys do the rating systems and you like getting comments and views, it's it's cool. That's actually good. I want that to happen because, you know what? It'll keep the community together, keep us talking, keep us having fun. And, uh, yeah, keep them all, like, rounded up. Keep Give them content of yours to enjoy so they'll stick around. That's what I want. Not... That's what I'm trying to say here. Give them content, fun content, uh, exciting, true, passionate content. Not content just to, ooh, to get ratings and likes and this and, and money and cash or monetization. No. No, 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 no. Don't do it for that reason. Uh, I know people are going to disagree with me on this. I know you're going to hate me about this, me saying that. But that is my opinion. Do it for fun. Do it for friendship. Do it to escape your lives. If you have depression, if you have this and this and that, you have disorders in your life, or come in here to have fun, not to hate, not to attain some fame and fortune glory type thing. No, that's not what it's about at all. And the reason I have subscribers, I say subscribe to my channel still, is because I want to spread a message like this to the community through my videos. I want to make, I want to change my channel completely in a new direction all types of new content um, I had opened a gaming channel before but I closed that I thought it was a bad idea after I did it and I'm gonna actually condense gaming to this channel too there'll be gaming coming to this channel there'll be comedy videos coming there'll be more reviews coming uh, true videos and uh, I'll talk about more of that in future videos that's not what that this video is about that's another video another day but that uh, yeah thank you if you're still watching this right now I'm sure most of you have turned it off at this point because you hate what I'm saying but I'm going to try to change the community. I'm going to try uh, to help it. Well, I'm not going to say I'm just I'm coming in like some badass or something. No, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying uh, I'm going to try to help support this community to keep us strong in the core and not get black and turn to the dark side or something like some of these troll assholes on here or people who want to go to battle for some reason over internet uh, videos and things about talking about collectibles and movies and things like that. Just not, that's what... You're gonna pick a fight over that, right? You're gonna start. You're gonna what? Well, someone's gonna go to a shootout and start a shootout because you know you disagree about something, or you know you get into a little argument and over internet and you're gonna go cap in the head or something. It's like no, that's just wrong, and that's uh, that's sick. If any of you feel that way out there, I'm sorry, it's true. And uh, if you should know that I I, I am true about this, um, a long time ago. Tell you a story. A long time ago in a galaxy not so far away, I had a brother, and uh, he's the reason I started collecting. Like, officially. I mean, I had toys when I was younger and such, but no. This was like 2008 when the Clone Wars first came out when I started collecting. And he passed away. Okay? Now, I'm not going to try to make this um, a deeper meaning thing. It's just, it happened. And. There's nothing I can do about it. I wish I could change it, but it's too late now. So that is the reason I started collecting. Because after that, I, I got so depressed. Uh, being a younger child, it really affected me. And I needed I needed an escape. And I like, you know, shit happened. And I remember going to a store. Uh, I don't remember exactly. I think it was a food market or something. And they had a little toy section there. And there was... A Captain Rex Phase One, like the vet from the release from the very first wave of the Clone Wars, the old style packaging. I'm, I miss those days. I love. I just love going to the stores and there's like hundreds and hundreds of them. Like at Toys R Us, they used to have a rack with like hundreds of figures, hundreds. And I love the design of them. Even if there were some same ones, there was always a chance of finding a unique, different figure in there. With uh, Hasbro's gone downhill since then, but um, it was a very, very fun time in my life. A very, very fun time. And. uh... Well, not what happened with my brother. I'm saying, like, uh, looking, going to all the stores and going out and trying to have fun. And it was just a lot of fun collecting at the time. You know, getting into it the first time I started with one figure. And now I'm at, like, 2,000-something. And I've had a lot of great experiences. I've met a lot of great people on here. And uh, the other reason I'm still sane, and not just you guys, my family, of course. I give credit to them uh, for sticking with me through this. And uh, we're, you know, we're holding strong. We're going on to the new, into the new years and uh, new beginnings, and and uh, you know, sticking together and surviving this world as long as we can, really. And uh, 
and you guys are part of my family. I consider some of you a part of my family, and and I I want you guys to have fun too. You know, so I want you guys to succeed, uh, to flourish. Uh, I don't want you to become one of these top YouTube assholes. I want you just you know to succeed though. I want you to you know have a blast. And for me, what I am on this community is I am. Uh, I guess some people will call me a hippie or something. Uh, I'm promoting peace. Yes, uh, I am peace. Um, peace. But I do not smoke marijuana, I promise. I swear to God. I swear to God. I never, ever did my entire life. Um, and I don't intend to either because I want to be honest and I want to express my true feelings coming from deep within inside my heart, from my brain, and, and expressing it outward with my mouth and words and describing it all. But. Yeah, guys. Um, for me, from now on, ratings are disabled. It's all about, I want people to subscribe to me so that I can spread happiness. I want to do daily videos eventually in the future instead of uh, once a week or every other couple of days or something. I want to do them daily. And I want to keep this, I want to um, give a little invigoration and strengthening to this community. I want to give you guys something else. So, so you have your reviewers. You have these top awesome reviewers here, here like... Uh, you have great guys to talk to, great people to have to share conversations with, or and all that. And then, like reviewers and re reviewers of different toys besides me reviewing Star Wars, you have all those reviews. You can go to them too, and of course, you can do whatever the hell you want. You can have fun with it. And so you have them. You have your reviewers. You have your movie makers, people who make stop motions. That's awesome too. You have that, and you have uh, movie reviewers and, you know, figure reviews, as I just said, and gamers, too, you have all that, and you can have so much fun with it, and, uh, that's what this is about, but, then you also have me, the sort of jokester guy, and, uh, I'm like, uh, the, the third wheel or something, like, the little extra guy on the side, and, uh, to help with strengthening the community, so I, so I'm giving credit to all you guys out there, there are a ton of you that help make this community what it is today, and I consider myself, I envision myself turning into one of you guys. I want to help the community the best I can and try to change the world, the realm of our community, and change it. And like I said, this is nothing to, to, to start up a war. My friends on here, everybody can do whatever the hell they want. Anything. Uh, for me saying, the only people I'm a little upset with or disappointed with is these people who think they're some top-notch guys. Like, oh yeah, I'm a badass because I got like 60,000 subscribers and I review action figures, man. I'm some badass. Fuck all these lower guys. I don't give a shit about them. That's the only nitpick I have about the community is some of you guys, you get a little too into your head with it. It's not about that. Um, even though I am saying I, I like to get more subscribers only to, to help spread my message so you have my videos locked into a part of your account I, and I want people to see this I want people to express their feelings comment down below if you hate me so much if you or if, whatever disagree go ahead it's fine it's cool but yeah and as I said it was it been a, it's been a while before like we my, my first video or of recent times like two months ago I was gone from the community for a little while and I had to take a break and for reasons being you know it was personal so and if people out there uh, you get a little tired of it you get tired of dealing with problems that's fine you can take a break no one's obligating you or any way to stay here and I'm not obligated no I'm, I'm gonna say this too no one's obligated to comment on my videos, to subscribe to me, to watch my videos, but people still do, and I'm thankful for that. Uh, thankful for any support that comes to here. It's uh, really great to, to talk to you guys still after all these years, and we're still here. And, uh, yeah. This is about fun. Not about, I don't know, whatever you guys think it is, or the, the dark ones. <laughs> uh, not to be offenseful or anything, but... Yeah, guys, um, it's been an amazing ride, and, you know, we've had our ups and downs, and I've had mine as well, but I left, and I came back, and I left and came back again, and, uh, this time, I think I'm sticking to it, uh, for as long as I live. I'm gonna, well, as long as the YouTube lasts, I'm sure it's gonna go to the shitter eventually, and we'll have some other website, uh, but, yeah, I want to help, you know, 
I want to just try to do something. I want to try to do something different. I want to make more. I want to make entertaining videos to give people a smile. That's what this is about, giving people a smile. And even if I get like one viewer, like I had back in the beginning, I'll be happy that I'm making someone smile at least. At least one person. And if I even do, I don't know for sure because I'm not watching their facial expressions because I'm not a computer hacker or anything like that. But, <laughs> like, the connection. Which the connect from Xbox One, which is uh, sitting right beside me right now, so you're gonna be extra quiet, guys, because the government is watching us. They're watching our moves. <laughs> all right, guys. Um, thank you all for watching. This is the Commander Thirty Five, Jake, and have fun with it. Do whatever it is you want to do. I just. You know, I want us to all band together and help make this community a bigger place, a funner place, a more exciting place. We got new stuff coming in the future, lots of new things coming. And I hope you like whatever I have to come out for you, too. I don't want to have any hard feelings, but I'm sure someone will feel butthurt from this. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, taking your time uh, to sit here and watch my, my videos, even though they're lame-ass videos sometimes. But uh, I, hope I'm, I hope I can get something from it like I'm I really am trying to have more fun with it so that other people enjoy it too and uh, yeah guys thank you for watching this has been the command 35 as I said love enjoyment collectors collecting peace all that good stuff thank you guys so much for watching